Well, Big Brothers Big Sisters of Kentuckiana has been changing lives and creating meaningful connections for children here for years now. Being a mentor is more important than ever as we gear up for back to school. I'm joined by Jennifer Hoffman and Antoine Terry to tell us all about it. Guys, good to have you here. Good to be here. This is the season. Like, I feel like this is a great time to get involved. It definitely is. And with mentorship being so important in the community today, we just are looking for those adults that care about children that that want to protect our youth and be that village um, to help facilitate their bright futures right and so what is the process like if you say yes I'm gonna find the time I'm gonna do this because it matters and to be a mentor people may be thinking oh, I don't want to do it because you know it means this amount of you know what I mean people think of their time yeah but I mean the value and the trade-off is greater but what would people anticipate just from the moment that they connect? Um, it is about two people, a young adult and an adult, just twice a month, just a minimum opportunity to, to make a big impact. I know that Antoine, he is a big within our program mm -hmm. and there are so many experiences that yes, we facilitate that, that special relationship and that bond between the mentor and the mentee, but we also have that ability to change the life of an adult because they're looking yes. at it from the perspective of a young person. And we go, you know, adults, we're a little bit stubborn and we, we try, to, try to not be so set in our ways, but I think that's the beauty of the program. Yeah. And it's beneficial for both the adult and, and the young person to just get different perspectives. How long have you been a big brother? Uh, just over eight years now. Oh my goodness, yeah. you really, you went into it, <laughs> didn't you? I got hooked. See, that's the message there, is that you think, oh, I don't know if I have time, and then you're in it, and you're like, eight years later. <laughs> How have you learned uh, from it, and and you continue to stay in touch with uh, the young people that you are a mentor to? Um, no, it's been an incredible opportunity, uh, something that I didn't have uh, when I was young, younger, so... Uh, the, the ability to be able to give back in my adult years uh, to, uh, to Littles has been, has been inspiring. I yeah. bet, yeah. I bet. Do you still keep in touch with many of, of those that you I do. have um, mentored? I, I, I uh, do the school to work program mm -hmm. through, through my company and um, several of them have moved on to university. So through social media or just through simple e email, we, we keep in touch. You wonder too, you know, when you look to see their success now, do you think, I wonder not me. just no. yeah. <laughs> oh, I did that. Yeah, I did that, right? But do you look at that and think in some small way, did having somebody to talk to and you know what I mean? Like That's I think I it takes a village with mm -hmm. a child, but you know what I mean? Like you were part of that village yeah. that encouraged a young person. I just think that's it. that's huge. Yes. You know? Yeah. And that's exactly <sighs> That's exactly what we're looking for. Um, Antoine, he's within our school to work program, but we have the community base. We have those young mentors. Mm -hmm. We have high school bigs. So anybody that is oh, looking to just facilitate that relationship with a young person and, and to be that village, to, to send that text, hey, how are you doing? To check up on a young person, just to make sure that they're on that right path. Um, that's what we need, whether it's through donations, whether it's through just people being able to to facilitate those relationships yeah. with the young people in our community. Um, and I know you all were recently, congratulations, recognized <laughs> nationally. So yes. the national organization uh, recently honored the Kentuckiana. Yes, um, and we, we received the gold standard award. Oh and what that is, is we met certain metrics within the national department, whether it's with fundraising or whether it's with um, keeping our bigs together longer. We met those national standards and we were one of 26 out of more than 230 agencies across the That's 50 huge. states that won that, that award. Which I think right now, it's just, it's such a tough time in general. Like we're, I don't know, it just feels like it, it, it is coming back so many years from COVID, people finding time, finding jobs, mm -hmm. but to create the time and do what you all are doing, I feel like that's a, an enormous achievement at this point in time, yeah. you know? And I think that that's the hurdle that we're looking to, to really bridge that gap out in the community. However you want to get involved, be an advocate, be an ambassador, mm -hmm. be a big for a day. And that's just a couple of hours that's volunteering right. to see what our program is like, because I don't know, I'm speaking for, for bigs in the program, but that hurdle is the time, right? Yeah. And if you think that it's just a simple text, it's just a check-in. Sometimes we don't need to spend time with people and our friends, but if we know that people care about what we're doing, and at that time, they're there when we need them. That's what's most important, and that's Absolutely. what involves mentorship. 
All right, still time to get involved before back to school. Here you go. Thanks Absolutely. to you both for stopping by. Uh, if you want to be a mentor or get involved in, in a big or small way, any which way you possibly can, just go to bbbsky.org.